My name's Sunita and I'm a second year pharmacy student. I'm an international student from Canada. I'm from a small town called Peterborough. It's in Ontario. Um, it's a very small town, it's kind of like cottage country. One of those towns where everybody kind of knows everybody. I am from a family of five. So I'm the oldest. I've got a sister who's a year younger and then a brother who's three years younger. And then we both, or all three of us live with my parents. I've always kind of wanted to do pharmacy. I mean, my dad's a pharmacist, so I was kind of always around it. So we used to go in and see dad at work um, to drop him off some lunch. We got to see what he did, and we never really understood what he was doing. But uh, as we got older and, you know, I could actually start working, I used to go in and do some work with dad, and I got a little bit more exposed, and I really, really enjoyed it. And so I thought, you know what, this is something that I think I'd like to learn a little bit more about and maybe pursue as a possible career. I decided to apply overseas. I would probably have never considered going to Australia because it's probably the furthest place in the entire world that you can go away from home. But I looked into it and everything just kind of fit. And so I decided, let's do it. And then I pretty much just packed my life into two suitcases and moved halfway across the world and here I am. Yeah, the city is really, really great. I mean, it's a big town, but it's got that small town feel. Australians, I find, are very similar to Canadians. You guys are a little bit more laid back here, and I'm still kind of getting used to that. People here are so friendly. Everyone's very welcoming. I mean, if you're in the city and you don't know where you're going, you can pretty much stop and ask anyone for directions. On the weekends, I mean, can't study all the time. So there's always tons of stuff to do, um, which is really nice because you can get out to South Bank, you can watch a movie, um, you can go for some eats or grab a drink. Kangaroo Point is one of the places I really wanted to see because the view out there is supposed to be beautiful. So I do get up there and do some study because it's quite peaceful up there. Um, but yeah, I've yet to see the fireworks because I heard they're, <laughs> they're pretty good from up there too. Actually, the first thing that I really wanted to do when I came here was I really wanted to see a kangaroo. Because I thought that you get off a plane and you just see kind of kangaroos everywhere. <laughs> Brisbane is very healthy and very active. Uh, the first thing I did actually when I moved here was buy a bike. It's pink and it's got a basket on it. Uh, I usually put my books in there and maybe some flowers and some coffee, but no, my mom teased me about it, but honestly, having a bike here is great. It gets you around almost anywhere you wanna go. Well, pharmacy's a professional degree, obviously, um, but when you think about pharmacy, you think of um, just working all the time and studying all the time, but UQ finds a really good balance in kind of being able to study, but keeping it really fun, keeping the stress out of it, because um, I don't feel overwhelmed when I'm studying. I mean, we obviously have our moments when it comes time to exams, but for the most part, I don't feel overwhelmed. The staff is really great. You can approach almost anyone at any time. The facilities at UQ and Pace, um, the UQ campus is just beautiful. It's very modern. It's really nice because we get to have a lot of the facilities that really help with our education. They're quite comparable to back at home, but there is a lot more technology that I find that Pace is invested in really making our experience very educational and really helpful with what we're going to do in the future. So we've got the wet labs and we've got you know the, the auditorium, the mock uh, pharmacies where we do our counseling. So it's really nice because it really does create like a really good atmosphere and kind of makes you feel like you're in a pharmacy. So when you do these counseling activities, um, it's not really overwhelming getting into the real world and doing it. UQ's got a special kind of program here where they do placements. And I think that's really great because there's a lot of uh, universities that will just, you know, they'll teach you the theoretical, but you don't get the practice of being in the environment that you're gonna work in. So UQ puts in a lot of efforts to really make sure that we get that experience. But it's really nice too because we get to work in a community setting as well as a hospital setting. Because pharmacy, as you know, is very diverse, so you can kind of work wherever you want to work. Um, so it's nice to be exposed to these different areas because it really allows you to solidify what you want to do when you're done and you know make a decision based on the experience that you've gained. Being able to really practice that and practice it in a real world setting, it makes the biggest difference, I find. Every time I go into a lecture and every time I kind of interact with one of the professors, it just really solidifies my decision to come here and I really feel that I did make the right choice. Um, I mean, not only academically, but I'm gaining a lot of really great life experience being here. I would say that UQ and Brisbane itself have definitely exceeded my expectations. I mean, I came here and I thought, okay, I'm just gonna study and sleep and that's pretty much it and then, you know, just rotate doing that for about four years. but. 
I feel like I've gotten to do so much stuff and met so many people and I definitely feel that when I go home in four years I would have put a lot of experiences under my belt and I'm really happy about that. If anyone was wanting to study pharmacy here, I would tell them to definitely pack their bags and come here because it's been the best decision of my life. And if they had the shot to do it, to definitely do it.